Oh, is that? Mr. Gex and Agent Extra had worked together for a jolly long time, solving international mysteries, putting away some very bad chaps. But it all came to an untimely end when Agent Extra was mysteriously kidnapped. Now, Mr. Gex has dedicated himself to finding and rescuing his lost partner. Without her, I fear he will be lost. So there is a plot. Gex! Gex! Agent Extra! You poor kidnapped minx. Hey, Tiger. Guess where I am? Trapped in the media dimension. Yo, live action video on N64? What? Hey, speaking of secrets, you want to see my. Gex, quit clowning around and get me out of here. This place is giving me the creeps. I'm on my way. Dude, can I zoom out at all? Yikes. Okay, now what? Yo, Wish. No, how did I do that? Off to a good start. Let's find Evil Santa. Why are the controls so much worse now? Like this? This is the tightest turn I can make. Oh my god, why? This is brutal. Let me zoom out. No. All 
All right, looks like this is the best we can do. Why do they make chicken sounds? I want to lick it, but my tongue will get or turkey. Back. This is better than something? This is not off to a good start. I was like really hoping that this would be better than the one before it, but things are not looking good. Better than Glover? I, uh... And one and two, you're I, I don't know, man. Hit me. Go on. Hit me. Obviously, I, I need to play this more, but I thought Glover was pretty good. That looks like it should be something. What year am I in now? I think we're still we're still in ninety nine. supposed to do here okay You're on the list. this is really fun when you uh have no death perception maybe i stand max distance i can see the shadow what's up Frey? i felt like the glover controls were pretty decent i don't know I don't think I had too tough of a time with Glover. All right, at least there's no fall damage. All right, can't go up there. Yeah, I'm sure I had a lot of this too. Yikes, you like this fresh maker. You'll like it more when you finish it. Oh, pork lover. Poor Glover. Apparently there are a hundred of those in every level. That is one powerful piece of machinery. Agit. Why is everything dancing? 
the, by far the worst thing in the first Gex game was the camera. And this one is not better. Oh, uh, okay. I don't know what collecting these accomplishes. What's up, Blue? Oh, jeez. Alright, we have done something. We gotta find these ice sculptures. We found one earlier. Nice. This was the one in the intro. Oh, that counts. Oh, I thought I had to get them all in one go. Like, I thought I had to collect all of these in one go, too. Maybe I don't? Oh, my God. Come on. All right, we got those. I think there are 10 of those. Swimming wasn't too bad, actually.
Hey. Somebody tell Jackie Brown I found her hat. Gotta love the thing. Just three. Yo, photo, what's up? Swingin', baby. Uh, it's it's going. You know, it's Gax, so it's not great. Alright, so it was up there. Oh, hey. I think your friend Rex might need a bit of a thaw. Let's get it on. Alright, we got two. All right, so the fly coins you do have to get each time. Hail time. All right, now we have to find snowboarding elves. Gotta figure out how to get there. Where's that Wonka man? Somebody gotta do it. All right, so not this way. What are they saying? Oh, this is Santa. Beware of elves. Okay. This might be it. Oh wait, this is where we were last time. All right, so just one. I don't know if you can get the collection remote and another remote at the same time. You know, like in Mario, you can get the coins along with another star. Oh my god. No. Triple lux for a triple clap, baby. Get 
get whacked. I see skate, ice skating elves. easy. I keep pressing Z and A. Weren't you on ESPN too? <laughs> to do the long jump, but it's R and A in this game. Dude, don't hate on the snowboarding games. All right, you can hate on whatever this is. You're harsh in my mellow. That's what he's saying. Isn't there a bonus thing down here in the preview? Check me out. I'm extreme. I wonder. Yup. Nice. Let's get it on. Pwned. Yep, we have a winner. So I'm guessing the fourth one is collecting 100 coins. So we'll try that. You better run. Eat this. Oh, 
swinging for the fences, baby. Nap time. Just confirm it only works once. Yes. It's just three, yeah. Where did that come from? Keep exploring out here. They're sweet, they're minty, they mumble. Oh man, there's really nothing up here. Is that like a line from something? My tail doesn't like you. Why is he talking like that? Dude, the triple hit. Oh, 50 is an extra life. No. If you jump through a doorway, you continue jumping on the other side. I was not ready for that. Back to 
Yeah, I wasn't ready for that. No one's ready for that. When does that ever happen? Super Metroid, I guess. All right. Number one, program the holodeck for something warm. This is from Mr. Sinatra. <laughs> Yeah, come here, penguin. Penguin turkey. Like there aren't enough over here. Just call me Chili Vanilla. My tail says hello. Where do we get the rest? Were there any in the snowboarder place? Cause these guys just disappeared. Let's go snowboarding now. Everybody is in the house. Yeah. Check me out. I'm extreme. I'm just a nose grabbing an indie away from the edge. Oh, all right. Four more somewhere. Warning, yellow patch, warning. 
so good. I can snowboard up. Oh, I actually have to hold forward. All right. All right, we gotta find four more. Colder than a supermodel stare at an all-you-can-eat buffet. Anything down there? Okay. And a one and two, you're a candy cane and dancing. Got got him with that one. Look, they peed it. They peed the message. Oh, three, four. Here's the question. Yes, you can get that and another one. Now we know. We didn't get all the other stuff, but I don't know if we care. I do believe that it's time to start the game now. Did I open that? No, I feel like I just opened that. But what's this? Welcome, sir. Please come on in. Entering the training area should allow you to brush up on your skills. Uh, what? Oh, is this a tutorial level? Press the attack button to tail whack those hideous dummies.
anything else in here? Gex for remix. Platforming. Is there just one in here? Trust nothing. I get that. Dude, just long jump. The long jump is like obnoxiously hard to aim because you have to be running. And that takes a second. Spend on this. No. Oh my god. Alright, screw it. I, I just don't understand why long jump just doesn't want to work sometimes. Stop making me explore. Thank you. 
Doesn't that wall panel look fake? Oh, that was the teleporter I tried going on earlier. There we go. No puking at any time. Oh, I went through a door. Wait, there are coins, but I'm not in a zone yet. Or in a level. So confused. Okay. I'm confused. I was like, what is that freaking clicking sound? Of course I missed it. Oh, I got it, alright.
know about I don't know about this zone right now. This is like, hey, collect some stuff for no reason. Alright, oil. I get it. You're slippery. But on sand? Come on. Oh my god, I only have 40 of these. Knock me down. Right out. What? Got in between my attacks. Oh my god, and I have to start over. Freaking kill me, dude.
Why are those flying guys so hard to hit? Secret. Oh, I thought that was a hallway. where I started. No. And I'm screwed. Unfortunately, it is in fact Gex 3.
Yeah, man, it's good to, good to get back into it. It's had a lot of stuff come up lately. Man. Lock and load, little lizard. Is there anything? Yep. That would have sucked if I had actually, like, gotten all this. Toad! Thank you so much, man. Gotta make this timer. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. How you been? You guys see this frame? Just in time. School stuff. That's no fun. Alright, looks like there are 18 in here. If my calculations are correct. Oh. Just gotta, just gotta get them all. Starting kindergarten, big steps. Oh my god, how? Freaking unbelievable. Oh my god, I just gotta wait another freaking lap. Come on, guys. Whew. Oh, and then I have to get there. No! <laughs> no! No! You love Enter the Gecko? Oh man. Let's get it on. I am not a fan. The camera and everything is just it's just so bad.
Is this one as much of a freaking collectathon as it seems? Oh, it's bad? Okay. Yeah, it seems like it. So, like, I get um, that whenever I get a hundred of the fly coins, um, that's a remote. But what are these, like, bonus coins and the green paw coins? Like, what's up with all that? Oh yeah, and the fact that you can't just like turn around, you have to like run in this little loop. Very annoying. Genuinely, you have no idea. All right. Wait, did I miss one? No, 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 I didn't. There's 18 in this room. This one. Never found a use for them. I pulled up the instructions, but I have already forgotten. Crazy here. No, I needed that to work. If I exit the bonus level, will I exit? out of my way. Yeah, I was that's kind of what I was worried about going to the hub world. Oh, come on. Come on, camera. Wow. All right, we got it next time. Yeah, just like the camera and the like the physics and the platforming, just most of the things about both Gex games, I really don't enjoy.
If I could just turn better while running, the game would automatically be much better. The first few levels are easily the best. Ooh. Things are not looking good for our hero. Why is that so difficult? Why was that platform on crack? Dude. Yeah, all right. You just can't make that jump. Uh, no, Josh, it's not. Toad, Toad here loves the original Gex. How? Where is the freaking... Oh, my God. Why won't it just let me get that? Looks like basically the same game. Yeah, it feels like it. Toad thinks this one's a lot worse. Um... Apparently, mostly because of the, like the collectathon style that they turned it into, which yeah, I would not like it either. Oh my God! Halloween at Rip Taylor's. Yeah, and freaking middle school me didn't understand any of those references. We're getting this stupid bonus level. Hail time. <laughs> you still have no idea. It's a Google search away, but you refuse to do it. I don't see the Pokemon. Abra. Oh my god, just jump, dude. Just jump. Beagle! What's up, dude? Hey man, thanks for the sub. Appreciate it as always. Welcome into this freaking catastrophe. All right, we got that one out of the way.
We have two minutes in here. We should be able to handle this. Should. Then I go and do stuff like that. Oh my god, that kick went really far. Because of course we are. How, like, why is this so bad? Why is this so freaking terrible? <sighs> All this for one remote. Look at these turns. That's the tightest turn you can make while running. Just absurd. But they thought that was a good idea. Oh my god. I hate, I hate this. I'm enjoying nothing about this. Turn camera. Holy crap. His little hat. <laughs> it's the only redeeming thing here. His Indiana Jones outfit. Even has like a satchel. All 
Alright, I just need to get this. This coin on this pass. Alright. I need to catch a ride. Catch a ride. Gax being a Smash Remix character? I mean, like, that's not, like, totally outside of the realm of possibility. Wait, why does it say zero remotes? Toad. Toad, what's going on? What did, what did I do wrong there? That's a bonus collectible? How do I get the remote in here? What? What else is there to do? There... Oh my god. You weren't kidding, dude. Why bother showing me what that did, right? Fourteen bonus coins. Okay. Can I kill those guys? Appear so. some health. Thirteen. 
Oh wait, there was health on the back of the pyramid. Aha! A shield of some kind. I don't feel protected. Yo, Boston, what's up, dude? Hell yeah. Uh, Mystical Ninja or Great Adventure? Oh, crap. Of course that hurts me. Another bonus. Well, if I go in there, I'm going to lose all these coins I've collected. It's tail time. Mystical Ninja? Nice, nice. Yeah, I love that game, dude. It's so good. Three staffs of bra. The Luxor. Mummies in secret. It appears that they go hand in hand. Swing him, baby. Thank you, Doug. I am the greatest. Good thing I have all these lives. Nothing to progress the game. Great. Damn, they weren't kidding. My brother Moses was here. That I can't decide if that's inappropriate or not. It's gotta be, right? <laughs> Perfectly balanced. I always say the headdress makes the man. I bet he doesn't always say that. Oh, it scares me every time. He dips down in the sand and I think I like missed a jump or something. Are those flying guys good or bad?
Okay. Oh yeah, don't jump out. Dude from Stargate. All right, so we don't know what those those things do. It's a mystery. No. Oh, it's just an extra life. Come on, turn around. Checkpoint. I didn't think that's what would happen. Mysterious handprints.
Checkpoint's pretty clutch, though. I'm a bad man. I got poopy pants. <laughs> All right, well, we found the camel. So maybe we come back here later. Really? Nothing attracts the ladies more than a dirty dighty. Jump on the camel to use it for transport. Use tongue to dismount. Paul A. Abdul. Uh -huh. Somebody's gotta do it. That is one powerful piece of machinery. Diglett. Diglett, dig, diglett, dig. From Mr. Sinatra. What the hell? Why? Just make it not impossible to see. Where is that? Why is this insane? I don't even know what that stupid thing does, but it's it's bothering me.
Like, it's not dead center. There, we got it. 58. Dude, I have so many things left to collect. Weren't those bigger gaps before? I know what to do. isn't bad I mean yeah it's not bad I'm getting a deal of TV to go here like we fought the dude in here he had some stuff behind his waterfall toad save me Oh, 
Oh, that's just the way you're supposed to get up there. But I cheated. What do you guys think? Should I get sucked under under the sand? Will that kill me? Or will it teleport me to a new place like Super Metroid? A headdress, a diaper, and I'm good to go. I'm doing it. No. starts here. That's nothing. Yeah, it's screw it. I'll just beat it. I thought that was hot. We're getting nothing. Whatever. Just get me out of here. Lock and load, little lizard. Yes, we have a winner. Shall work on the riddle of the minx, and that means you, Nefertata. Hey, Caligula, just get me home. I don't know. I was already doing the same thing, man.
Dude, I don't even remember like how to get back there. That just took me a freaking eternity to get one remote. This is not the place. Yo, Chimera, what's up, dude? This game is, uh... Not... Making me happy. Let's do this. Where is that? The legendary, the pageantry, the luxury. All right, Josh. We freed one spirit. Where are the rest of them? Hit me, go on, hit me! It makes it seem like the rest of them are this way. Uh, is this one of those pyramid schemes? the ladies more than a dirty dighty. There really was nothing here. Oh yeah. This was the staff room, but I somehow didn't see this. Alright, I'm mad. Like I'm back at 54. Dude, the perspective is just so freaking terrible in this game. Like what is what is going I on? I always there? say the headdress makes the man. 
Just let me move. of the world, underdog! Underdog. Gex for Smash? Yeah, I guess I, I'm, I'm with that. What is this camera angle? Expecting that. Dude, what is this freaking nightmare feel? You guys seeing this? Uncanny Valley. My tail doesn't like you. Camera, please. Here we are. Pismo Beach and all the clams I can eat. How do you like me now? Forget about it. Is that a Star Gear reference? It's tail time. Yes, we have a winner. Let's get it on. Oh, this time it just put me back here. That's nice. That's where the first one is. Dang it. The legendary, the pageantry, the Luxor. <laughs> you 
mummies and sheep. It appears that they go hand in hand. Making that like the only breakable wall is such a tease. I'm back at 54. Swing it for the benches, baby! Phew. Alright, it's so like, is there something in this room I'm missing? Let's go camel path first. I always say the headdress makes the man. at 50. Yeah, Kyra, Practic. Uh, 
Maybe that's Toad's favorite joke. This is from Mr. Sebastian. Nothing attracts the ladies more than a dirty daddy. I'm very confused by that. Paris. That was intense. Josh. All right, so that's the camel one. Gotten one. Alright, and the third one is in that other area. And that 
into the face. The face area. It's not great. It's not great. I'm not a fan. Same issues as the uh, first, the first Gex game. And then there's this. Yeah, I mean, it should be a good game. It's just the, the camera and the controls are not great. And apparently it's kind of brutal as far as, like, collect-a-thon stuff goes. Eighty-four. Yeah, like, I'm definitely missing some. That sucks. So close. I'm missing nine. Nine! Mad Rush! Two more of those. I don't matter. I should get your Yep, yeah, that's uh, that's been a popular thing to say so far in this stream. How about these? These should be in remix. Nightmare faces. Dude, being six short is so lame. Oh, uh, being four short. Oh wait, there they are. We found them. I just don't know how to get there. Yeah, 
Yes. Let's go. Lock and load, little man. That was awesome. <laughs> yes, we have a winner. Hell yeah. That was like better than I could have hoped. Ten remotes. I'll screw you, dude. Dude, if Gex was in Remix, like, basically all of his moves would be custom. Because he just doesn't have that much source material. Like, he has this attack. He has this. And he has this. And, and the down tilt. Like there was a door that required 11 somewhere. to drive a tank. if they see me. Hey, forget about it. Oh. Okay. Helmet is gonna muck my hair. No pepper games.
accessorize this. A handbag, some buttons, a bobble, a bow. Hello, Tatsu snipers. Stay in the foxhole maze. No, the first Gex was on PlayStation, and then the second one and third one were on N64. That's why 64 has Gex 64 Enter the Gecko, followed by Gex 3. Gex 64 is actually the second one. bothering collecting those. I'm not gonna get them all. What the hell is going on? What the hell? I made it all the way here. Note to self, don't get killed in big loud war. No. 
did I miss? Destroy all the lights. Alright game, what do you want me to do? Come on, chaps, those snipers. Stay in the foxhole, maze. Because I didn't say the magic word. this tents We weren't exactly looking hard for them last time. Chicks dig me because I rarely wear underwear. And when I do, it's usually. Yeah, Josh, you easy. already have a golem. You and me, we already have golems.
New Jersey. Oh, I was not expecting that. Nothing like army clothes for total comfort. Alright, right hand roll. That's the sweet stuff, darling. Bonus now. This helmet is gonna muff my hair. Now we can't get out of here because the stupid camera. Curb your lizard. Definitely sounds like a euphemism. Have any Pokemon? Damn. That was amazing, sir. Well done. Try and get Golem again. Watched it nice. It's been a while since I did. I'm getting a real TV. If you need something to, to fill that, that void, I recommend uh, Mr. In Between. Oh yeah, dude, he's he's garbage. He's just like an egomaniac.
Yeah, it is harder to notice the first time you watch it. True Detective, nice. Well, seasons one and three. But yeah, dude, I like highly recommend Mr. In Between. I really enjoyed it. Season 3 True Detective was pretty good, I think. What the hell was the point of this one? Mr. In Between is on Hulu, well, yeah. Caught, uh, a box of these. Are you crazy? Yeah, it's, it's FX, so it's on Hulu. Also, it's FX. There you go. That's how you know it's. Uh, that's how you know it's decent. slow here. Don't know where anything is. Oh, there we go. Uh, no, it's just the Pokemon thing only shows up when there's a Pokemon. So every s seven and a half minutes, there's a 33% chance of a Pokemon showing up. I think that's how it works. So you just had to destroy all the towers. Okay. I found zero of these crates. What the hell are they? Also, wait, I thought the, uh, the tent thing was here. of the NFL games. Yeah, I don't know. I have not checked. Uh, probably not. We have at least one more Blitz game, I think. 
So at least there's that. Freaking 59. Not even close. Madden 2000, NFL Quarterback Club 2000. Ugh! That's brutal. Oh, I need to freaking gift the substream elements. No pepper games, whatever that means. Oh, two Blitz games, all right. I already went there. And then we couldn't go in here. Yeah, well, so Slobo, all those games came out on the same day. Yeah, I don't know what to do here. Alright, fine. Hail time! Yes, we have a winner! Yeah, pretty rough. It's hail time! All right, where are these? There you go, another Diglett. Where even is this area? Ryan, I don't know Ryan, but oh, okay, those doors open. There you go, Madrash. I saw those doors open, and I don't know why I thought going through them would make me exit the level. That sucks. Wasted a bunch of time. Any game I'm looking forward to next? Um, yeah, I think there's a few coming up soon that I'm excited for. Um, I have no idea what Hybrid Heaven is, so I'm kind of excited for that. Um, I'm really not excited for Tonic Trouble, because I think it's terrible. Uh, Goemon's Great Adventure, for sure. Army Men, I've never played an Army Men game. Jet Force Gemini, down there at 80. Uh, I think the Hot Wheel game might be good. Dig me because which I is, rarely wear underwear. Which is nice. Is usually something unusual. Because uh, I appreciate a good racing game. And there's a lot of them on this console. And they can be quite bad. So getting a good one is nice. Yeah, I've heard I haven't heard anyone say they don't like Jet Force Gemini. I mean, sheesh, there's even a Jet Force Gemini stage in Smash they Remix. Drab, they mean drab. So it must be good. I forget, was there anything down here? I don't think 
Astros. The Pentagon spent $25 million on this one level? Yeah, Mario Party 2 came out pretty late, and look how, look how quickly they pumped out Mario Party 3. Like, <laughs> there was not a lot of time between those. All right, you're annoying. You. Okay, jump. Road 64 is decent. Okay, I assumed it was bad. Yeah, Mad Rush. That, we've been talking about that for a long time. Mario Party 19XX. Like, for sure. That and uh, a hack of Mario Tennis where people can play as the same character. Yeah, MCW pwned. Oh. It would have been good to see Mad Rush versus MT. But alas, it just wasn't meant to be. Yeah, how did you and Empty not play each other? Was it not CCG 1 and then you and Empty 2 and 3? Oh, you put the bear above you. Right, guys, we can all agree. That's silly. Yo, HRG. Good to see you, man. going all right man it's uh, been kind of a crazy week or two but I had a little bit of free time so I wanted to play some Gex see how it was
Nerds. Crazy for you too? That sucks. some health behind here. No. All right, yeah, stable, steady. I can get behind that. I did the same thing. I was like, wait a second. Hogan, 40 days in the cooler. I don't get that reference. Sixty. All right. So we're just hoping there are forty in the other zone. Yeah, man. Still, you know, delivering that mail. I just didn't even try and go this way. Your brother's a mail carrier. Nice. City or rural? City. Yeah, I, I'm I'm rural, so get paid by the route, drive the truck. I like it. I get why people like city too. It's just like infinite hours and overtime. Daily overtime too. Not weekly. Which is nice. Yeah, it totally goes either way, right? Sometimes you love extra hours. In general, like right now, I don't like need a ton of hours. So I like not working very much. It's like I still have other work, you know? <laughs> Gamer will be like, oh, surprise, we have four events this weekend. <laughs> at the beginning. Where I am. No, Z is not shoot.
that wall really not blow up? I don't, I don't buy that for a second. Being a rural carrier is like, it's a speed run. That was amazing, sir. So I get to have fun with that, like, aspect of it. Try to find, like, all the little time saves I can. Four more. One! I missed one! I bet it's back in the other area. Damn it. Rhyhorn. It's been my fear. I would be missing just one, one of these times. Where's the freaking exit? Oh, Israel, what's up? I can accessorize this. A handbag, some buttons, a bobble, a bow. Throwing Pokeballs is hard, man. You ever play Pokemon Go? Dang. Just missing one remote. I feel like it's gotta be in the other area. Dang, this sucks. Nothing like armor clothes for total comfort. All right, everyone's favorite thing to do. Search around for that one thing you missed. Uh, I think you can do Pokedex, exclamation Pokedex. But that'll just give you a number. Uh, I think some people have modded this enough so that like, you might be able to like look at what you have. I'll have to go back and check. Isn't that the one for... Oh, whatever. We, we gotta find this remote. Yeah, or or it's not hidden, and you just, you just missed it. So far, this game hasn't really hidden things. Like there are like hidden essential things. There are some things that are that are intentionally hidden because they're bonus. But the essential things are like usually pretty easy to find.
Is there was there an exit in this area? I really should have paid attention to where they dropped it. Hey, no kidding! Did I miss the make love, not war level? Hey, that was it. We have a winner! Dang it. I gotta do this stupid tank thing again. Know, little lizard. At least when I drive the tank, I don't have to think about how annoying the Gex is to control. This helmet is gonna. All right, where does hair. this go? That was amazing. Son. Where was that? A good chunk of uh, remotes. Fourteen. I think I might stop here. I think I might stop here. Try and stream after work tomorrow or something. Actually, no, let's find that bonus level that I unlocked. Let's go there. How do I get out of here? Get me out of here. It was in the pyramid. They're mellow. All right. Obnoxiously difficult. Warning, yellow patch. Warning, check me out. I'm extreme. I'm just 
with the nose grabbing an indie away from the end. I'm right on top of him. Find these idiots. All right, so three of them are in this top area. Let's get it on. Top two down. I'm just a nose grabbing an indie away from the end. What? Guess where I am? Trapped in the media dimension. Rez is back and he's kidnapped me to get to you. He's attacking your secret island cave. Hey, speaking Toad, of Toad, what's up, dude? You wanna see my Gex, quit crawling around and get me out of here. This place is giving me the creeps. I'm on my way. Oh my god, I have no idea where to go. Alright, so all right, gotta remember the controls. No, we don't want that. And a one and two, you're a candy cane and dancing. Um. Okay, R. I was like, how do I... Don't drink the tap water, Jerry Garcia. <laughs> Alright, so R and jump is the kick. R and B does nothing. How did I... How did I lick something? What was that? Yeah, man, it's good to... You know, put some time into it again. I just, I'm so lost. Like, I, I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I think I did a lot here. Um, I don't know what these icons are for. <laughs> Blake Flaccid, nice. Like, I'm collecting the paw prints, right? Yeah, I really should have done that. 
I mean, the last, the last stream of this, you know, it was only like three hours. Slappy Valley. I guess I should go there. Funky Town. All right, so I did pretty... All right, I got this place. The Egyptian level. I played this like, holiday broadcast thing. Tough TV. I remember playing um, in like a winter place. Oh, there's so many levels. Oh, this is terrifying. So I feel like I, I already went here. Holiday bro. Okay. All right. All right. So we definitely did that. And then... Oh, Z is lick. What's this? Oh. I feel like I didn't do anything in here. Mystery TV. I thought I... I thought I saw that on there. Oh, okay, guess not. Lock and load, little lizard. Guess we'll go here. With my trusty magnifying glass, I can spend the entire day burning ants. All right, psycho. What does collecting these things do again? Zoom out, all right. Enough gets a bonus remote. And is that worth it? Do I want bonus remotes? I think I got enough of them in one of the levels I played already. Ah, uh, yes. The mystery of the two-brimmed hat. All right, so we found one of the uh, coolers. Which we need to break for one of the other... Oh wait, there's another one. How do I get that? Yeah, I know in 64, in the, you know, the first one, it wasn't necessary. All right, so we're, we're jumping on dudes. Okay, okay. Do I do I want that? Probably. 
that my shorts are too tight, and I like it. And I like it. All right, we get it, we get it. Let me skip it. Oh. So is that good? This is the kind of uh, action we, we've been missing. Those statues look like switches to me. Yeah, thanks, dude. Yeah, I figured it was a health thing. Oh, is that just not in this room? How? How do I get it? Like even if I could get that like running jump, no, that would make it on there. Yeah, like I figure it's the long jump, but you can't get a running start to do the long jump. I feel like I lost the best. Oh well. All right, so now there's a bear. So I guess there's like switches or something to access the other coolers. Like it should be a thing. Oh, there's another. My tail says hello. Night, night, baby. All right, so I guess we're going there. Homing bullets. Sir, try standing on the magnifying glass icon and looking around you. How do I look around me? <laughs> what? No, I don't like this. Doesn't like you. This is from Mr. Sinatra. Yeah, I love the thing. No, please don't kill me. I'm 
confused. Did I do it? And that's how you know it's a masterpiece. Yeah, I always feel a little bad for anyone that's like, oh, Gex is my favorite. It's like, oh man, I'm sorry. Yeah, actually, I've, I've come across a, a few people. And, you know, it's just come, it just comes down to, like, that's, you know, this is what they played when they were kids, and this is what they remember, and they had fun. But, like, obviously, it just doesn't hold up now. Okay, so it was this room. Okay. There's just nothing else up here. Oh yeah, what is it like? You get enough of those those green things, and it gives you an extra health bar. That's what it is. Good thing I got an extra life. Yes, I saw the magnifying glass. Hold on, guys. Just looking around. Wait, you actually think this one is worse than the first one? Oh no, I'm, I'm concerned. I see, I feel like the controls in both are bad. Oh no, dying resets the collectibles. Okay, yeah, we're just not bothering with those. Do I keep the other stuff? Yes. That was like my biggest knock on the first one is the controls and the camera. And you're saying this one's worse? I don't remember it feeling worse. 
Granted, I never, like, played them both back to back, you know? Yeah, I, I figured if you were saying that, you'd probably, probably play them back to back. Yeah, I mean, that's a. Have you played uh, Tonic Trouble? I feel like that one gives uh, Gex a run for its money for bad 3D platformer. But I've only seen a little bit of it. So it's hard for me to say. Alright, where is this hedge maze? Oh, screw you, dude. You liked it a lot? Okay, I only saw like a few minutes of it and it just didn't look good. All right, so in your opinion then, oh wait, that's probably the hedge maze. Um, this is the worst uh, platformer. To swim, use the duck button to dive and jump to stroke. Jump to stroke, guys. Good thing we already learned how to swim. Oh, Blues Brothers 2000. Okay, I didn't realize that was a, like a platformer. I don't know why I thought that was more of like an action adventure. Just right hand roll this. Oh, what is that hitbox? Lock and load, little lizard. Yes, we have a winner. Progress. We've officially made progress. Well, sure. Earthworm Gym 3D. Okay. Thank you, my dear extra. Now what's say? All right, where was that? Did we go through here? No. Adam, what's up? It's tail time. All right. Break the three colors, beat the three mini. Oh, the three mini games. Okay, we did two of them. The bear. Yeah, we already. No, we saw the bear one. Show me the one I haven't done. Again with the the burning of the ants. Where's the bear ones right here? Oh, I have to hold the uh. What? Oh, 
Gotta work on my spacing. There's nothing for me to collect. I have not played Hybrid Heaven yet. Hold on, is there a game in the maze? Is there a game in here? Lovely point of view here. Amazing. Wow, what an awful sound effect. All right, yeah, I guess we continue. That's the one. Complete disaster. Okay. Actually, I think that one's coming up really soon. Um, you know, soon on the list. Knowing me, who knows? I think we're just hoping there's a mini game in here. But it's not looking good for our hero. Oh yeah, isn't it great, so? Gex for remix. Yeah, it would've been great if they showed me where the three games were. They have so many taunt lines. Now I will tell you the origin of the universe. Like that. All time classic. I say only the money, baby. Definitely that. Dude. Oh, you guys can't see him. Here. No, how do I get out of the way? I gotta look at Bert. There. Look at him go. He's building a nest. Oh, he finished. Okay, what am I doing here? That, the face on that statue looks like uh, a character from Mystical Ninja. <laughs> Uh, emblem on the floor, on the ground floor. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll go back and look. I mean, that's like the only other room where there's not a whole lot going on. Um, there are a lot. Hey, Zadie, there are a lot of um third-party controllers out there. 
Um, so it's very easy to find if you're just looking for something like casual um, and you're not concerned about like, you know, authenticity or anything like that. I mean, you can look on um, Amazon or there are companies like uh, like Retrobit and um, Retro Fighters, uh, stores like Castlemania Games has different ones and there are different styles too you don't even have to like have the original design they're like more modern looking controllers that plug into the console there's so much stuff out there uh but if you're looking for like good quality original controllers sadly you kind of have to uh oh there's one right there nice you kind of have to either be like check on ebay and know what you're doing or or there's a, an n64 controller market facebook group um where you can buy like you know legit original controllers from generally people that know what they're talking about Face this way. When the evidence is overwhelming, I'm not wearing pants. Uh, for Smash, so it depends. You know, if you're again, if you're trying to like play a lot competitively. Um, the jury's kind of out on a lot of the aftermarket ones. No, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Um, but there are people that play with, uh, like the Retro Fighters, uh, controllers. Um, the, I forget. There's like two different like controllers that look the same, have different names. The Brawler. The Brawler. Um... The only, uh, the only thing about some of the aftermarket controllers, and if you get really into competitive Smash, is like, we are very rough on controllers. But even the original ones kind of die. Yeah, both of them are, are Hori style. Dude, I don't, I don't know, man. What, what the heck am I, what am I doing? Where is Alicia Silverstone when you need a real clue? Alright, so there's the one door here. Yeah, uh, game... So, uh, some people also will play with a GameCube controller. And they will... Um, there's an adapter you can get uh, to plug... If you're trying to play on console, uh, there's, there's a console adapter that you can plug your GameCube controller into your N64. And there are people that use that. So if you really like the GameCube controller, that's a great option. Wait, did I just never go in that little door right there? Yeah, I don't think I ever went in here. Oh, because they're, okay, I get it. They're like, you know, taxidermy bears and they were standing on the, and now they're alive. Oh, we found the bar. Very poorly stocked. T 
Toe sent me on a wild goose chase with the symbol on the floor. What if I do this? Do I have to tail with them? Hi, Bert. What's up, man? Bert gets jealous if I'm talking to other people. Hey, Ethan. Like if I'm on the phone or if like Libby and I are sitting and talking. So right now he probably thinks I'm on the phone. That was easy. See, Soap, the worst thing about Gex for Remix is he actually would be a good character. <laughs> this game just sucks. Like, I, it'd be a really interesting remix character, right? So many different outfits. Uh, actually has, like, you know, several attacks. Um, there's different, like, items you could work in. Yo, so how come this time I went right here? I didn't go to the starting area. And yeah, obviously all the voice lines. Alright, I don't know how we're breaking these coolers. Alright, so is he saying with my trusty magnifying glass? Because it sounds like a very different word to me. Alright, let's... We know how to get the one, you can just jump up there. Gex camera, activate. Like we got this one. But how, how do we get those others? Can't do that. Yo, James, what's up, man? Good to see you. Dude, I can't tell you. I, I went on a big, like, Shadow Man bender after, like, during your playthrough. I was, like, looking up all the info about the, the remaster beta and, like, getting all excited about the new stuff. Memeing about Shadow Man for Remix. Alright, so that, yeah, that doesn't do anything for these coolers. Dude, seriously, so if you end up getting the remaster, I highly recommend getting it on Steam at this point. Because Steam is the only platform where they're releasing uh, beta patches. All other platforms are not getting updated until it, the game is completely done. Um, and there's just so much more stuff on the beta right now. Like, uh, there's a whole new game mode, a whole new difficulty. Um, along with, like, boss characters and stuff. Like, there's just so much more to the game. Yeah, the new difficulty, though, is called the horror. Yeah, that's not going to work. And uh, the way it works is you get one save per zone. Unless you, like, travel 
there back or you get like a like a quest item like an important item enemies do not drop health <laughs> um enemies are stronger and enemies have extra abilities it's pretty crazy dude what am i supposed to do am i crazy am i like dumb what am i missing here Can I get on the chandelier? Yeah, like, whoa, how do I get those? <laughs> More difficulty. No, but even, like, ignoring the extra difficulty mode, there's, like, all these new zones, like, completely new zones and and enemies uh and cutscenes and and voice voice lines um items like there's a new voodoo weapon um things are in different places just like some things nothing crazy it's just it's so freaking good man and the updated controls with like hot swapping weapons and stuff is incredible. Like I know updated controls is always something that like people get extra excited about for old games, but I usually like the old controls, but in the, oh man, in this it's it's amazing. Okay, how do I get these freaking things? Bird is not happy. Wait, have you played this one yet, James? I can't remember. I, th I feel like you played a Gex game. Guys, he's building a nest again. Look at him go. Look at that little butt. Where is Alicia Silverstone when you need a real clue? I guess there's nothing else in here except for... What is he doing? Yeah, I, I know you're not going in release order. So I just wasn't sure if you had played it yet. With you, I have like a 50-50 chance, right? You're you're like halfway done? More than halfway done. I look like Helms, but I feel like Columbus. Lowest Metacritic to highest? No. That's a really funny concept, though. Dude, you would just play so many sports games in a row. Yeah, okay. Oh, you did get the Turok, too. Nice. It is a long one. Um, it's so good, though. It's so good. 
but it, it's it is long um, and difficult. The the level where you're like in the caves and stuff is tough. Definitely. I don't remember the rest of the game giving me too much trouble, but that level. All right, what am I what am I doing here? I seriously I don't know what to do. Saving Mario for last, nice. That's what the beast is doing too. Oh wow, you never really played it. That's cool. Yeah, it's like uh, when I got to Ocarina and everyone was like freaking out because I never really played it before. For the record, it was good. I think Shadow Man's better. <laughs> uh, I like Mystical Ninja better, but it's a very good game. Nice. I guess I might as well collect these. Wait, where are the bears? This room. To the maze. First to the pool. All right, so there's got to be something for me to do in that room then. No cool uh, diving board action. Honestly, not bad swimming mechanics. Not bad for this uh, this era. Oh what! Also, I really don't like in these games when um it like so it, sometimes it lets me like turn straight around, but other times it like loops me around, and I really don't like that. Give me instant turning. Okay, so it's not just me. Kill this bear and turn around. Lights out. TV. 
I really missed that earlier. see that switch. Alright, we're gonna go back to that. Not what I had hoped for. How far along are you in Turok 2, James? Oh, there wasn't. There are two more? In... Yeah, I really like that game. It's so much better. It, like, it's exactly what a sequel should be. Like, all it did was just improve on the first game without changing too much. So that's how we do it. What will cause me to glide? Okay, R. Yeah, dude, the first... <laughs> please, please don't watch my playthrough of the first level. I did so many loops of that place, covering every freaking inch but I kept missing the same thing over and over because I was taking this one teleport to do the loop and it was skipping this one section. <laughs> oh man, that, that hurt. That, that hurt my soul. I only have 87. Yeah, dude, I went, oh my god, I, I did, I went through it so many times. Hmm. Okay, so that's not gonna do it. I do want to look around for those things I've missed. Thank <laughs> you. 
Can't just do that. Okay, so now we can hunt as Vampire Gex. Is there anything else in here? Pressing duck whilst in the air will cause one to glide. I want to stay a vampire. Oh, uh, actually, I guess I need the magnifying glass. I think the remaining things are in the mini games. I think. Maybe I just imagine that. Let's go up here. There's nothing better than a good menthol in the morning. Got those. Got everything in here. We didn't go in here yet. And the last one. No. Now we can get out of here. Take that level. Let's get it on. Yes, we have a winner. We did it. Hell yeah. What the heck? All right. Why won't you open? The heck was that? Flies, I suggest you 
five paw coins adds an extra hit paw to your health, sir. Sir, 100 fly coins in a level will earn you an extra remote. Are there more consoles for me to bounce on? I need the I need the cloak. I need vampire gex. Secret. Lock and load, little lizard. The heck? Okay. Dude, what the hell is happening? Well, if they're... Oh, okay, I was like, how do I push it out of the corner? Okay. Oh my god, just turn. Just... Turn! No, that was it. Oh, I had to push a barrel down there. Wow. Wow. It's tail time. I'm guessing that's what I had to do. There's a barrel in that room. Can we see? No, we can't see. Yeah, dude, turning, turning in place. Thank you. 
I wonder if it has to be in front of the lock, or it could just be in front of the door. Is there anything up here? No, just... Alright. Yay, I'm a genius. I solved the puzzle. Wait, there's a remote in there? What? Let's get it on. We have to explore. Alright, so it's just all the TNT in here. Alright, great game. Alright, so we're just hoping that we see something in this last room. Or is it like beating it under a certain time? Is that how you get it? I think that, that might be it. Maybe beating it under a minute. Is anyone with the knowledge? Is anyone here with the knowledge? Oh yeah, we trapped now. That might be it. We'll try real quick. I mean, it only, you know, it'll take two minutes, three minutes. Because I feel like there was something similar with the other, the last, like, bonus level I did. Yeah, I guess I'm just doing them because, like, I don't know what else to do. I also don't know why I wouldn't do them.
Oh my god. Go, go, go. Oh my god, let me turn. Let me turn in place. Holy crap. We have a winner. All right, who knows? It's a mystery. I don't even know, like, wh what did that get me, you know? What's this? How do I open these doors? What's this? Dunce and candy cane. How fruity. What's in the rec room? Welcome, sir. Please come on in. Entering the training area should allow you to brush up on your skills. Nah, pass. <laughs> Hard pass. Alright, it's the only door in here that's open. Yeah. Alright, so this, and this is where, like, I really just didn't know what to do. It just felt like there was this huge area, and I didn't know what I was doing. Like, there's that teleporter. Like, I'm guessing I already did that. Oh, yeah, the war one. I remember that one. Western Station. Okay. So what is this? Let's get it on. It's funny this that guitar actually sounds like like you know no mercy or revenge or something my tail doesn't like you now your head you smell a rock hard cooking Rock hard. That's the bottom line. 
All right, so we got to add Rock Hard to Remix. How many games are there? There are 296 official console release games in North America. There are an additional, like, 81 or 83 Japanese games and an additional, like, between 6 and 9 PAL games. Like, what did that get me? There are so many things to collect in this game. I don't know what's happening. Definitely rock hard for Remix. What's up, Comical? How did I not do that before? It's right there. Halfway there, yeah. I've, I actually am exactly where I was over a year ago because I haven't played. Um, no, uh, 40 Winks. Um, it was like a game that uh, I think people got working on on console. But like it was never officially officially released by Nintendo. Uh, there's also a group that is working on making uh, Dinosaur Planet right now. But again, like that was a canceled game that became Star Fox Adventures. All right, we did the pyramid level, right? I'm guessing that was. Tut TV, Holy Moses, yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty excited. Have you been following that project at all, so? I didn't realize how, like, far along they were. I actually, I also never played, um, Star Fox Adventures. All right, is this a level? This reminds me of the ship level in a uh, Mario RPG. for racing games oh so um a lot of games it's just about like getting to the credits um so like f-zero i think i just beat i beat all the courses like on you know gp mode or whatever i i did beat it all i like um it was on the default difficulty you know i didn't i didn't put it on like very hard or anything survive the wall of death not a very good wall of death if i can survive it But like, you know, racing games, I know like th those are, in my opinion, those are the hardest ones to beat because, right, so that is a switch. They, um, cause they don't like get easier. You know, you just have to get good at the racing game to beat it. Uh, I do some sometimes manage to like find some cheese that helps me a lot and like playing it over and over does help you because you learn the uh the tracks but like man you just have to get good so i shoot it in the teeth 
I better shoot in the eyes. We're all with me that the first instinct is teeth. I know the eyes were glowing in red, but... Come on. And yeah, the, the credits. Um, some games, though, like... Like a wave, like wave race is a great example. If you do championship mode on wave race, it starts you on novice, and then like normal, and then expert or something. I think if you just beat it on novice, you get the credits. But like, you know, not play beating on novice unlocks regular, and then it unlocks expert. So like, you kind of, if you don't play the whole thing, it doesn't feel right. Uh, Extreme G is another game that was like that. Oh my god, yeah, Diddy Kong Racing is a long one. Um, but yeah, I, I you know, I, I beat the whole thing. You know, Wiz Big 2, all that. So, I mean, games like that, like, I don't mind. Just like, you know, playing it all the way through. It's a good game. Alright, we gotta find this wall of death. Dude, that guy just like Hadouken me. And this, this is where the camera just absolutely kills me. Am I supposed to jump on those barrels? No. Okay. Jet Force Gemini. Yeah, I've actually never played Jet Force Gemini. I, I know a lot of people really like it. Um, I've just never gotten around to it, and any game, once I started this challenge, any game that I had never uh, played before, I'm just, you know, saving it. What is this doing? Yeah. Oh, speaking of N64 Metroid, there is another fan project that's being worked on right now, and they're calling it Metroid 64. I don't know if anyone's been paying attention to that one. But that could be pretty sick. Really fun uh, mechanic there. Oh, there are ropes I can climb up. I get it. Which is good. It's just good for situations like that. Yeah, Metroid 64. Um, I don't remember, like, who, like, what the Twitter handle is of the person that's doing it, but if I'm sure you can just Twitter search Metroid 64, or you could probably just Google it at this point. Someone's probably written an article about it. Uh, it's just gonna be like any other, like, action-adventure game on, on this console. It'll be, like, you know, third person. Oh, it's Wall of Death time. We, we made it. I'm alive. All 
Alright, was there like stuff on the walls? On the sides? Oh wait. There was, okay. Nothing green though. Never been impressed with ROM hacks. Have you played some of the Banjo Kazooie ones? Or some of the Ocarina ones? There are like some really well made ROM hacks on 64. I won't even get into Super Nintendo. Also, uh, Goldeneye. There's like two solid Goldeneye ones. At least two, which, you know, maybe more. Oh, I get it. Oh my god. I didn't even hit it. I mean, no, I'm too scared. Let's get it on. <laughs> too scared to go to the door. Yes, we have a winner. It's tail time. All right. Wall of Death survived. Sink four pirate ships. Zip on down to the TV. Okay, so we're, we're climbing. Night, night, baby. Yeah. yeah, obviously massive remix dub. Remix is awesome. The team that's, that works on Remix though is also, I mean, without actual knowledge of all of this, it's gotta be way bigger than any of the other ROM hack teams out there. So it should be better. But then you have people like Kirko that are just like freaking legends. I mean, he doesn't do it all himself. Um, I think he definitely has someone do music. You would think that. Even, even the, like, when you have all these people working on Remix, and, like, yeah, most, the vast majority of people play very small roles, but, like, it all adds up. Uh, yeah, Remix is the, the hack that, it, you know, it adds all those uh, characters and stages and, uh, I mean, just tons of features and music and everything. Oh, there. No, 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 I thought there was a climby thing there. The trim on the wall looks like the climby stuff. I don't know why I'm collecting these things. I guess it's good to just find it all. Uh, but like one of the coolest things about Remix for a lot of people is that they don't change any of the original characters so like if you want to just play the uh, the vanilla you know original game you you can so that's very cool
Yeah, I... I, I left that part out. But yes, they did give Kirby the ability to absorb the remix characters. Can I like jump on the barrels? Sure can. This reminds me of Mortal Kombat Mythologies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I beat Smash. Yeah. So I'm, I'm going in a chronological order. So, um, and if you do exclamation progress, you can see the order of the games and, you know, what I've beaten and a bunch of other stuff. Yeah, that cannon. Where was that? Oh, come on. There's a rat. Here, rat. Wow, sir. Them treasure chests contain treasure. Them treasure chests contain treasure. I... Banjo Tooie, nice. Solid. I don't think I've played Banjo Tooie pretty much since it came out. So that'll be a pretty, you know, new game experience for me. Oh, I'm supposed to jump on that thing. But I. Ah, you never finished it? Yeah, actually, that's why I never uh, really played through Donkey Kong. I just got so uninterested. Oh, oh, we're parrying now. Oh, am I supposed to, like, use the cannon to shoot the guy? Yeah. Yeah, that's what they want me to do. Dude.
camera does not know how to handle me right now. Alright, we're, we're doing it. Get juked. I don't need no stinking cannon. But I might want it. Oh my god. Where are my ropes? Aren't there ropes over here? So, like, is there more stuff to collect in Tui than in Banjo-Kazooie? Because it was just, you know, notes and jiggies. I don't know. It was a lot, but it didn't feel, like, overwhelming. And it didn't have, like, a dumb mechanic, like, character swapping and Donkey Kong. Understatement? Okay. I don't remember. Backtracking? Oh, like once you get abilities, you have to like go back to the zones. That sucks. I thought I was gonna have to like race the wall to get these, but uh, there are these little alcoves. That was interesting. 
Oh, the only way to get it. Oh. Damn, really? I write stuff down? I did that with uh, Zelda on NES because I was on a plane when I was playing it the first time. There's just nothing there. I'm very confused by what I'm supposed to do there. I get Hold the game still. Is that supposed to just be another? Okay, it just ends there. Well, that didn't feel like a waste of time at all. I'm a sucker for bugs. Damn it. I should have gone in that door at the beginning. I'm not going to be able to collect all the things now. Why would I want to see where I am? Yes, why? Why indeed? I just realized that I have a peg leg. Show me the money, baby. Big hurt. How did I kill that one? Guess like that. Hmm. 
Wee. Turn Yoshi into get. Oh yeah, someone could like make you know a very rudimentary Gax just like put his model over Yoshi, but you know we want we want the whole Gax. Oh. I didn't I didn't know we were doing that. So how is that not the zip to the TV? Isn't that what the remote was? What, what else am I supposed to do? Stop making me do this game. I guess I didn't like need to, need to. Oh, this is the destroy the four pirate ships. Angelica, thank you so much for the raid. What's up? Hey, Sharpie. Were you uh, were you arting it up today? No, you were you were Resident Eviling it up. That's what it was. What's up, Toast. Dude, but but uh, wow, pre patch, Angelica, you gonna get on that? This guy's cruising. I tried reading him there. What? Did he juke me? I literally just started, Sharpie, like right now. <laughs> um, 
I hadn't been at it in a year. So here I am. Yo, how do I get back up there? Oh, that's how. It's going all right. Yeah, I've just been uh, just been busy and just couldn't bring myself to hit that start stream button. Yeah, I just make excuses. But uh, I was like, screw it, dude. It's been a it's been a year. Maybe maybe wow tomorrow. Yeah, it's uh all the new um the new talent trees are out. So that might be It's kind of it's a little overwhelming cuz they they they're pretty massive talent trees with like a ton of options. But that could be fun in and in and of itself just like picking all the new talents. All right, we are so close to having the 100 um whatever they are flies. So we are going to go backwards. If I can. Can I go up? Can I get up there? Is that a thing? I see a rope. There's gotta be a way. And there's more little icon thingies. All right, clearly there's something we missed. Yeah, man, it was a uh, quite the quite the break. It's not like I needed a break or anything. You know, it's like, oh, the N64 challenge is really wearing me down. I just like got busy and kind of ignored it, which sucks. Haha, -ha, I see you. Oh, TNT. Oh man. It is hard once you once you stop, it's definitely hard to get back into it. Cause like I said, you just like make a lot of excuses. You're like, oh, you know, I'm I'm doing this or this is I don't know, you just But it definitely feels good to just play something again. How have you been, Sharvy? What have you been up to? You just finished something big recently, right? Sick zip line sound effects. All right, we gotta kill this parrot. Wait, there's two more? Dude, if it's all the way back at the beginning, that's so sad. That's like mega depressing. And it actually might be. Oh, that's brutal. We're doing it though. We gotta race the wall. K 
King Saturn. Hell yeah. Saturn's such a cool system that I, like, know nothing about. There was nothing there? No! So I just have no idea where these missing two things are. Oh, that's... That's annoying. My tail doesn't like you! I'm missing two, so it might be one of these treasure chests somewhere. Oh yeah, like obviously there there are some that are really tough, but in general, a very cool system. Just saw, like some really good like shoot 'em ups and bullet hells and stuff. I like I like those. And then like all the like the beat 'em ups are good. I saw a lot of really good stuff. Got that. Oh yeah, great, yeah, fighting games too. Oh wow. What? It pulled me up and then it dropped me. It's messed up, man. At least you don't have to deal with Freaking! What, what what what's this? Fifth gen, fifth gen cameras. Basically going through the whole level again. Looking for these two stupid bugs we missed. Yeah, I mean, they just hadn't figured it out, you know? Like, some games, it's, it's pretty tolerable. Most games it's pretty tolerable. In some it's just rough. Like Gex. Alright. Did I miss one in here? like wall alcoves on the other side. Uh, the first Mario Party, um, I just, I don't think the games are that good. Uh, there's a lot of RNG and like, if you lose a mini game, you lose coins and I, I I just, it's not that, especially when you compare it to the two that came after it, I, I just don't see a reason to play it compared to those, you know? Which is why I would rate it like that. 
like a meh rating is basically just i mean play it if you want but i'm not really gonna recommend it how do you like me now it means there's probably some people that like it and there are i know there are some people that like that game Man, this sucks. I can't like climb this, can I? No. Nope. Yeah, things are not looking good for our hero. Oh, I literally have to go there. Yeah, I like Mario Party 2 the most, um, but I will admit that a lot of, there are some things about Mario Party 3 that are definitely better. <laughs> yeah, you have to constantly tell her she's wrong. Yeah, I mean, she is. Just objectively wrong. It's all good, though. them all anyway all right well it doesn't matter now never getting it r.i.p thank you fifth gen camera Well, that, that kind of that hurt my soul a little bit, but we march on. All right, well, now we're just speed running. Where are you at, wall? Oh, come on. I got time for this. Oh, I can't believe I fell off the freaking shit, man. Just do the pirate ships. Man, that really sucks. Oh, ahoy. Oh, ahoy. Oh, ahoy. Oh, 
Dude, the inverted controls <laughs> mess me up. Alright, we did it. That was Wipeout? Wipeout was okay. Wipeout was alright. I, I understand, like, ra racing games definitely, like, not everyone's cup of tea, so I, I totally get where some people would just, like, really not like that game. But, like, as a racing game, it was, it was alright. Oh, wait, I don't have to do that. No, the really controversial ones on there are, like, people freak out that I don't like snowboard kids. Um, or, like, NBA hang time. But you gotta remember that I'm playing all these games single player, so that's how they're getting rated. It's tail time. Yes, we... Yeah, yeah, that's fair. I, I get it. What about Hydro Thunder? You play Hydro Thunder? That's a good one. Obviously, it's like an you know, arcade port, but it was good. I grew up with F Zero on Super Nintendo. We also had it on N64. Um, I played a ton of it. But I think overall, I prefer Extreme G to uh, F Zero. Oh wait, I still have to. We're starting from scratch. BPN, thank you for the follow. Very much appreciated. Where am I supposed to start? Oh, over there. Racing games in general. Oh yeah, Hydro Thunder is good. Um, actually, if you one of those tab one of those tabs on my sheet, I rate racing games. It's funny. Uh, when I got to uh, whatever World Driver Championship, the one I played for like 21 hours, uh, there was someone in chat that played that growing up and like loved the game. So they, they had a good time. Uh, not a huge fan of that game, but it's pretty decent. Yeah, Extreme G, Wave Race, Diddy Kong Racing. Dude, I just got blocked by that stupid thing. Oh, that's annoying. So it makes me do this part again.
There have been some brutal racing games, though. Like, difficult and bad, and the combination of the two. Like, I really wasn't a fan of the Rush games, because I just had to play them single player. And, like, the rubber banding and everything was just insane. Did, I really liked uh, Top Gear Rally, and then, like, hated Top Gear Overdrive. Dude, single player rush, I, I don't know, man. The rubber banding really killed me. Like, it just would make me angry. That in the game is, like, kind of jank. You would just, like, look for these shortcuts where you could, like, fly off into the distance and crash and then hit that reset button and have it, like, port you out in front. I'm all for jank, but that was, like, pretty funny. Jump! 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 God, this freaking game. <laughs> Why did this have to be what I came back to? I think I might have some rough games coming up, though. I know the, the like, five NBA game block is not far away. Yeah, very arcadey for sure. Um, the second rush didn't have as much of that. Oh, screw you, dude. Uh, I, I felt like I couldn't cheese uh, rush two as much. Oh, no, we cannot. Did Rush have all like the col the collectibles also? I could see liking that game a lot as a kid, right? If my goal is not like just to beat the game and I'm like doing all the collectibles and stuff, I, I could see it being pretty fun. How did I get up there? Yeah, the Mountain Dew can. Okay, yeah, yeah. I think at one point I was like trying to collect some of them because I thought I could get a better car. I forget. Oh, Hot Wheels Turbo Racing. Okay, yeah, I've heard that's good. What? His parrot's trolling me. Oh my god. Kill me. Hey, yeah, dude. I, 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 yeah, I think at one point I was trying to collect a lot of this stuff because I thought it might make it easier for me to beat the game. Dude. Um, one thing I really didn't like about Rush, uh, or so, like one of the like general mechanics of the game was how like, driving over a curb um at high speeds just like clipping a curb would could make you like flip over and stuff it's like dude i you don't need to be that realistic like <laughs> that kind of drove me crazy All right, it's good enough for me. Sad we didn't 100% it, but 
You know, made some progress. But now, where do we go? How can I? I need more thingies. What is that switch, man? How do I get it? Why can I not save? Or like, you know, look at my stats or anything. Why is it just pause? What's, what's going on here? I thought I could do more. So we just got to find another level now. Really? It's just nothing over here? Can't dive here. X monster. Hot dog hill. I want a hot dog. Alright, what's behind the waterfall? It's gotta be something. There always is. We already beat this. like we beat that too. What happens if I get a hundred of these? Out in the open world. There's poo in there.
did that. That's where we come from. Now the fire hurts me. I think we did that one. Yeah, not sure where to go here. Oh my god. Alright, we're up here now. Oh, we want that. Wait, does this go around? It does. No premarital gex. Alright. That was a, that got me. That got me. That was dumb enough. Oh, there's just nothing here? It's just a freaking hole in the wall? Why? Why would you do that? Josh likes pre premarital gex. This is a Koro joke. Okay, I, I kind of remember this. Oh, it's another secret. Okay. I don't know if we care about that.
with this camera. Stop. Hell yeah. Let's go. Um, where do we want to go? Oh no, we actually wanted to go that way. Still just pause it was sixty-eight hour. I don't know if we'll get a hundred. Yeah, I don't know how to get in there. The Oregon Trail. All right, that's another level. We've collected so many flies, though. Yeah, why? Why show me what that did? Why? Why would you do that? Right? That would be stupid. <gasps> no. Dang it. Why did it have to do that to me? I want to know what that freaking switch did. Alright, so you can't bounce on it. Alright. That's annoying. Might just be another way to get there. Seventy two. Actually, this would be a good time to go back to the beginning. See if I can hit a hundred. Unless that's a whole new zone. No, it is. All right, I hate everything. Dude, if you're moving, it's pause. If you're standing still, you can do that stuff. It's taken me five hours and 44 minutes to notice that. Also, wow, nice waste of time. I mean, I guess I like know where to go now, so that's cool. But also, screw you game. There better not be 28 flies back there. Oh, is that switch for that? Let's see.
Holy crap. Genius. All right, so far six, eight, ten, twelve. Okay, not. Let's get it on. True grits. Where are these chicken crates? There's not one behind the waterfall? What kind of game is this? Oh my god, we're donkey platforming. <laughs> oh man. Alright. We gotta we gotta we gotta run that back. The it's not mine. hole. Gotta pay the troll toll if you want to get into that weird man's hole.
That's all we got for it—an extra life. Who cares? Lock and load, little lizard. Climb a dung heap, climb a mountain. Collecting. We're climbing the dung heap. Sweet, cactus hurts. Sweet, that's a cliff. I cannot go up that. I actually didn't. <laughs> I like forgot you could stand still with the donkey. No one needs that to be that bright. I apologize, everybody, for the sound effects. supposed to be getting everything. I could use a siesta. Wow. Oh, there is a hell here. Oh, this is going to be climb the mountain. Why, where's my donkey? Oh, right here. Right, we're not letting him get away with that. Eat this. My tail says hello. Big hurt. Forget about it. Uh, that guy might be invincible. Yo, Frey, what's up, man?
Prey, you missed uh, another easy remix ad with uh, Rock Hard. All right, well, I don't even know what I'm doing. Rock Hard, it's a character in Gex 3. Much beloved by all. Is this Gex climbable? Yo, chill out, donkey. Yup. here and this freaking donkey sound effect it's getting to be a little much Like, does it really have to be every time he jumps? I, I get it on like an attack, maybe. Yeah, 1841 is a rough year. Sixteen. All right, I'm guessing this is the climb the mountain one. It's tail time. We take those. Yes, we have a winner. No, darling. I was thinking of heading into town, getting my tongue scraped. Hey, quick draw. I have another idea. Why don't you get back to rescuing me? Dude, why you gotta port me all the way back here? Twenty-two remotes. I did not like that level. Thank you. 
All right, you gotta find the freaking dung heap. Dude, frame rate. Oh, is it just that? I didn't go this way. Poop Town USA! Josh, how is this not your favorite right now? A screenshot, Josh. Poop Town USA. <laughs> good, good, good. All tab with audio. Little did you know. Oh, that's yeah. I like. It's so annoying. He makes a sound whenever you jump. And attack. Like, we really didn't need that for when he jumps in a platformer. Go on! Oh, that one's so easy. It's right there. Sorry, sorry, I'm jumping. Only when I have to. Oh, and when I dismount, apparently. Poop Town! Wow, that really was like right there. Lock and load, little lizard! Yes, we have a winner! Hyper. I guess I could. I could set up a second camera pointing at the new bird spot. Alright, we found two of those cards. I'm going to find Billy Crystal's smile. So we got the checkpoint.
Oh, come on. trust the donkey for this delicate platforming the other one we had already found. Sorry, donkey. <laughs> Almost didn't make it there. I swear, the donkey just kept running there. Scared me. Battle up, hombre. Cool. Just nice little impossible to see.
Find that last card. You never knock me down. Oh, come on, that hurt me. Why couldn't it have just been there? Crap, man. Gecko's got to know his limitations. Was there another one on the way to Poop Town? go through the mines again. Wow. Frame rate really does not like this. Come on N64, you can do it. Sorry audio people. We got here 24 remotes 24 what is this?
So let's see, there's the uh, one, two, three, four, five. Five levels we haven't found yet. But where are they? Where's that? Just don't know, man. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna go back to the start and see if there's anything there, and then I just call it a night. Uh, kind of a busy day tomorrow. And by kind of, I mean very. Oh, so I need those two secrets. Alright, this wasn't open before. Was it? I was worried I was gonna need 25 remotes to like get to the next area. And I was going to be annoyed. Keep off the freaking flowers. Or what? Oh, hey. I guess this is the place. Was there something at the end of that wall? Come on. Yes, there was. Where are the purple ones there again? Oh, extra lives. Take those. And what is the requirement? Can't read from there. It's 
20. 16. Not quite there. Um, we'll get, we'll try and get one remote from here. Get it on. I thought it said luck your way to the top. Dude, holy hell. You know, these missions are really cutting into my me time. Oh, I get it. I'm super strong. Sir, then press jump again to let go and swing yourself across the gorge. Okay. Not, I did not need a new platforming mechanic. Very much not needed. Can I just regular jump? Yes. Actually, that might make this game easier. Hit the jump button, apparently. Yeah, actually, that's way better than actually having to play the game. I can see the tail whipping the wind and will activate the soul geezer. I believe you can use it as a shortcut. sure which way to go. I'm a manly man. Guess I'm down here now.
Hercules. Milton Burley's the name, Pumpin's my game. What? My tail doesn't like you. Smell heroes, my friend. Let's see. God gamer. All right, we'll take that one and we'll get the hell out of here. No! What? Dude, he just killed me while I was AFK? Dude, we got mega trolled. I think the remote is still there. It's not. Oh my god. I think I'm getting close. That's amazing. How Jack Gex is.
Dude, I can't believe that stupid thing killed me. Oh wait, what's missing one? Oh my god. Are there any down here? I don't think so. Oh, come on, game. It's like it knows I just want to stop. Leather-like clothes feel so good on my leather-like skin. Right, we got... Okay. Dude, I almost did it again. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> no oh Patrick god, it's so loud. Whew. Let's uh let's hit the old stop on the timer. And uh And you poor kidnapped minx. Hey tiger, guess where I am? Trapped in the media dimension. What? Rez is back and he's kidnapped me to get to you. He's attacking your secret island case. Hey, 
Speaking of secrets, there we go. You want to see my Gek, quit clowning around and get me out of here. This place is giving me the creeps. Uh, you didn't expect live action video in an N64 game? All right. Oh, it's R. Okay. Yeah, like, <laughs> remember how to play the game. Alright, I think I, I did that. Clueless? Oh, like, clue. This is the second worst part. I've already done all that. Yeah, second worst part about the stream is when you haven't played a game in forever and don't know where anything is. Okay, so there's just those two places here. Is that called Lake Flaccid? <laughs> what? <laughs> I never noticed that before. It's kind of funny. Dude, I just I just need to know where the hell to go. Keep off the freaking flowers. So edgy. Did we play? I don't know what this is. Geeks? Geeks. Oh, is this like a bonus stage? Hell yeah. I guess that's what. Because, of course, you don't, like, you know, reflect the fireballs back at them or anything like that. You just wait for a cannon to appear out of the ground. So that you can blast them. Makes total sense. Yo, James, what's up, dude? I just popped into uh, HRG's channel for a sec. I saw you there. How you been? Did you um, did you end up finishing Turok 2? Oh, come, what? Hell yeah. I wasn't sure if you would finish it, just because I know sometimes you don't uh, necessarily finish a game. 
It's a really good game, though. I'm glad you finished it. It's tough, though. It can get kind of frustrating. Dude. I'm still hoping we get some Turok uh, content in Smash Remix. Like a, even just like a stage with some music from like Turok 2. That'd be that'd be good. 28 hours. Yeah, I think I was around there. It might have been 30 for me. I had a few times where um, the game froze on me while I was trying to save. That definitely, like, definitely hurt me there. <laughs> yeah, so I just based on um, how long it took me, I'd say I'd say 28 hours is pretty solid for a first playthrough. Like, I, what did I just get? What is that? Yeah, I don't know, like, I don't know what it was for me. If it was, like, you know, the the file I had on the EverDrive, or, I, I don't know, but that sucked. Because, I mean, you know you know how it is in that game. You finally get to a save, and, you like, you, you've been struggling, you know? And then to have it all just disappear... All right, is this like the... All right, so I remember this is like the last level I played. Oh, okay, this is a bonus. But I played like, like an ancient Rome, ancient Greece level. Oh, it's right there. Oh, okay. I had just started it. Let's get it on. Three hours and once. Yeah, it, it was brutal, dude. Have you played um have you played Body Harvest yet? Cause uh it's gonna be like that in, in that game too. Not quite not quite as as bad, but pretty bad. It's a hard game. Oh, you said, oh, wow. Yeah, dude, it was, it was tough. That was a tough game. All right, let's, we're not going to collect everything. Let's try and find this ogre cave. Oh, can I? Okay. Go towards the target to grab hold, sir. Then press jump again to let go and swing yourself across the gorge. Okay. Come here, piggy. The fourth area, I remember, I don't know which area it was. I feel like it was, I don't know why I keep thinking Siberia, but I got pretty close to the end. And then I like, I went backwards to an old save point. Cause I thought like that was a good idea. <laughs> but by doing that, it like bugged out the game. 
and then uh, I couldn't progress. So I actually had to um, like replay the whole freaking thing. It sucked. All right, this is looking like. He doesn't even say hot, 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 hot. Is this even an N64 game? Oh, we're gonna battle the ogre. Let's go, idiot. Oh, there's... There's multiple. Multiple ogres. There's... Oh, guy. I want that. Ooh. Oh, there's another one? Oh, and a bonus? Um... How do I get back? Like that. Just missed the jump button. Milton Burley's the name. Something smoking. I thought I had more health. Dude, freaking super wrecked. Dude, I'm trying to jump. Ah. 
I assumed we weren't able to kill those guys. Dude, is that how you get the remote? Oh, come on. I thought we just had to get here. No. We have to actually kill the ogres. Is there one like near the beginning I have to get? Yeah. This is from Mr. Sinatra. Oh, sweet. Wait. No, there was another one. sucks I know Bert paging mr. Heston mr. Charlton Heston Charlton Heston is uh it's been her right Do I just coll go collect all these? Another one? There is. Close one. Yo, Chris, what's up, dude? Sorry, I was I was deep in the Gex thought here. Bert, what are you doing? Yeah, I think I'll, I'll go back and try and collect them. Yeah, I live, man, but uh, barely. Oh, can I go back that way? Hell yeah. So we gotta go all different directions. Yeah. 
Chris, how come we didn't see you in uh, DK December? I really thought we'd see more people play, like, just for the memes. DK's your worst character. <laughs> oh, it's up there. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, Halloween at Rip Taylor's. I'm doing okay, man. I've been uh, really busy this this whole month. Um, pretty much since like the last time I streamed, because I streamed it like like early December. But then we like started putting all these plans in motion and do all this house renovation, and that started on like December 11th ish, like my birthday, um, where we had like you know, like gutted two of the rooms in the house like the kitchen and the dining room, like down to the studs and it, you know, the house is, you know, like, a, like 1900. So it's all like old, you know, like slats and plaster and stuff behind layers of other crap and getting that all like rebuilt, like the drywall and drywall put up and got to redo plumbing in the kitchen and the bathroom. And luckily it, you know, a friend of ours is an electrician, so we at least get a good rate on that. But uh, tomorrow, I'm going to try and cut the hole in the new countertop for this sink. And once I have that actually, like, up and, like, with the sink mounted and ready to go, then I can finish the the plumbing in the kitchen and then once the plumbing in the kitchen is done I mean then it just then it feels like I'm getting back to normal at least I, I still have to like build the rest of the wall cabinets and stuff but at least we'll have a working kitchen sink. Once it's done, it's done. Hell yeah. Yeah, I posted some pictures on Twitter of like what it looked like, what some of, I don't know if I posted both rooms, but what it looked like after some of the demo and then after the drywall. But I, that's, that's all I posted. Yeah, building cabinets is, I mean, it's easy. These leather -like clothes feel so good on my leather -like skin. I'll take, I'll take that over a lot of the other stuff. I'm pretty, I'm pretty done with painting and drywalling right now. I don't really want to do any more of that. <laughs> painting wouldn't be so bad if I didn't have to paint the ceiling. That's like just so miserable. Am I just supposed to jump here? No. Oh, they're under the bridge. We get there from there. I'm guessing. Hiya! 
Oh, uh, replacing windows? I have not... I have not done that myself. Just like I drew it up. It's only that side, right? Yes. I smell heroes, my friend. I think that the next thing I'm really not looking forward to is uh, doing the floor in the kitchen. Like, it's just going to be like peel and stick vinyl, because that's all we really can do in there. Unless I wanted to pull up the whole like subfloor and stuff, and I, I don't want to do that. Um, but that just feels like daunting for me, just because it's... The whole floor, and you have to be like pretty precise with it, and can't really make a whole lot of mistakes. I don't think. I don't know. Maybe it'll be really easy. Yeah, I, I, I don't want to do it, man. I do not want to replace windows. Like, I've, I've done a lot of things myself. That's not something I, I, I want to do. At the buzzer. Dude, where am I going to find 20 more of these? So I feel like I got everything up here. I got the two pigs. This is what I hate about doing the collect 100 thing. When you get down to the end, you just like have no idea. I don't know, I felt like it was always easier to get the 100 notes in Banjo-Kazooie, but even then, I guess sometimes it still got really stuck. Yeah, I don't know, alright, let's, let's get out of this section. How's this compared to 64 though? Uh, it's hard for me to remember back that far. I think maybe this is better than the first Gex on this console. Oh my God, I'm an idiot. Like I just remember really hating the, uh, the camera and some of the platforming in the first one, and I, I don't like it in this either, but it might be better. As, you know, as I say that. The way your momentum carries over in this game is really whack. Sometimes you just like, don't go anywhere. Wait, where the hell am I? Get me out of here. The bridge. I need to get back to the bridge.
He talks a lot. Really, he talks less in this one, you think? No, Chris. I actually quit my job. Um, right, like, very beginning in December. Like, the week after Thanksgiving, I think. I, I, like, I, I, if I had still been working at the post office this this whole month i i would have had to pay people to to do a lot of the work i mean i would have been making money working at the job but i definitely would have been paying people it just it wouldn't have been possible uh, to do all, so much of the stuff i've done myself Oh, okay, I didn't even go here yet. Yeah, so the thing was, I'm like, like, okay, you know, I guess I'll, I'll, I'll quit. I'll quit my job at the post office. Like, I still have my other job. You know, I get a lot of work doing all the PG bootcamp, you know, all the YouTube stuff. And then like the next day, the world tour got canceled and glitch got canceled. I'm like, hold up guys, <laughs> hold up. Can we, can we please not, <laughs> can we not do that right now? No, why didn't it catch? Can I do R jump? Yeah, okay. We're gonna be doing that on some of these from now on, cause I don't I don't trust the detection. Yeah, Toad, me too. It's just it's so miserable, and I like it's insane that there's actually like a group of people that think that they didn't have to cancel, that they like made this up, like. Like, yeah, dude, they, it's all just been, it's all been a lie. <laughs> like, what are you... The, the Smash World Tour truthers. Oh, I didn't know it was a double. Oh, we're going for the triple now. You guys ready? Crap. We're still short. We're short seven. Crap. Yeah, yeah, all the all the money that all the money that VG Bootcamp has, right? All that money. Oh, there's a bonus there. Alright, so this is like the start. Are we back at the start? Yeah. Come here, piggy. Oh yeah, forgot. Like yeah, the, the notion that they've had no intention of running the finals this whole time. And there are people like, oh look, you know, Nintendo in their statement said that they never said they had to cancel it's like yeah you're right they just they just canceled all that on a whim just because of a misunderstanding like how stupid do you have to be to believe that <laughs> is there anything up there can i look around Right, I gotta test all these pigs. All right, you're clean, pig. Oh, 
Incredible. Yeah, exactly. It's just, it's so insane. The World Tour Truthers, man. It's, uh, it's something else. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I got them all that direction. We'll go back to the ogres. <laughs> yeah, let's say cancel it for fun. For the lols. Dude, I was gonna make so much money that weekend too. <laughs> so that was that was a like you know, a whole paycheck I missed out on just just for that one weekend being canceled. I mean I'm not the only one, a lot of people a lot of people missed out on some big paychecks that weekend. I don't, I don't know. I don't know where these last seven stupid bug things are. It's gotta be like a whole little cache somewhere I'm, I'm missing. That timing, yeah. Uh, getting all 100 gives you another remote, I think, which, you know, because uh, as far as I know, your access to different areas is limited by how many remotes you've collected. So it just, I guess, in a way, it makes it easier to get places. Oh, I see one up there. But I don't, like, actually know if I really need to do it, you know? Because I haven't played this game. I haven't watched people play this game. So I, I don't know how crucial those are. Those extra remotes are for me. One level I had 99. That sucked. Just could not find that last one. Oh my god. Don't do this to me, game. I believe Toad in everything he says. No, Toad, where are they? The last two? Wait, yes! <laughs> oh, we did it, all right. Hell yeah. Oh man, that feels good. That feels good. Oh, I, I didn't get that bonus one earlier. Maybe I'll get it now. Uh, Toad, is it worth it? Like, can I ever collect a hundred of those these bugs in like the overworld? I'm kind of confused by that. I I don't know if I'm close to the end, Chris. I honestly don't know. We're gonna lick our way to the top. <laughs> That's how you get things done in the Gex world. So are they just there for fun? Like why are these bugs in the overworld? Humpin? The coins in Peach's Castle, they're just there. Well, at least in Peach's Castle, the coins give you health, right? That's how you get health in Mario. In here, they would just 
like actually serve no purpose. I refuse to believe a game as refined as Gex 3 Deep Cover Gecko would just put something in that doesn't serve a purpose. I'm also guessing it's not worth it to uh, try and get all the bonuses. Because I could get that bonus, right? Okay, I didn't know if it was like worth it, like if there was a purpose like to getting the bonuses like does that benefit me in some way I don't think I've 100 percented any of the game even like Shadow Man I did all souls but I didn't 100 percent the game All right, so that's it for this area, I guess. Dude, Shadowman's so good. I, I love when I find other people that are fans of the game. James did not have as good of a time playing it, and it, I'm sad. I get that the controls aren't the best, but man, the game is so good. But if the controls are the your main issue with the game like holy crap the remaster is so good i i can get people not like loving it if they're playing it now you know like for the first time it's there's some there's a lot of dated stuff in it like i i get it Yeah, I so I being lost is very real in that game, um, and that's another advantage to playing it back in the day. Is like you had the instruction manual, and that came with a map. Like, you know, not a great map, but holy crap! But it was a map. Yeah, it's a map of the overworld. So like it shows you where the coffin doors are and and how many soul like how many levels you need to pass through them and it also shows you where some major like items are. Yeah, I, I know James. I, I I remember like being lost, like again, being lost, not being able to find things. It's very real. Um especially like you know, in the overworld, so much stuff looks the same. Like, it's kind of easy to to get a little lost. But, um, no, I, like, I really can't recommend the remaster enough to people. It's so good. Uh, there was some, I don't know what publication I retweeted that voted it. Um, like, best retro game of the year. But I was like, yes. Lock and load, little lizard. Ooh, Shadows of the Empire. That is tough, dude. I like I'd have to go back and look at my playthrough. I honestly don't know how I beat that gladiator droid. <laughs> I don't know. Like I don't even know. It was tough. The game's tough. You could have just said fun. Took would have taken less effort in saying forget it. Oh, uh, I guess he he could have instead of doing the entire expression.
So those guys have two in them? Is this where I came from? Yes. All right, maybe I just climb it. Collect stuff next time. Zero out of 10 experience? Oh no. What? Around may be the only way to find bonus coins. Oh, okay. Whoa, what the hell is happening? Don't fall. All right, I should have listened to you. All right, I'll listen to you next time. Okay, that is... Alright, well, we don't care about the bonus. <laughs> is that just supposed to show me I can climb that? Okay. Well documented. <laughs> I mean, I, I get it, like, not every genre of game is for everybody, like, you don't, you don't find a ton of people that can, like, just, like, you know, go from shooters to fighting games to platformers, you know, to puzzle games, it's, it's tough, racing games, like, you know, my, like, a weak point for me is definitely, like, I, I, didn't play that many um like puzzle or or tetris games so like you know i get through them eventually but compared to like you know playing a fighting game even if i've never played it before like i have an easier time with that getting through charlie charlie blast territory was an experience Dude, come on. Yeah, Banjo's Banjo's a good game. It just like it just controls really well. It just plays well. Like the collectathon aspect of it, I I totally get not liking that. But it plays really well, and the soundtrack is really good. Okay, am I just not supposed to try and land? I'm not even going to worry about that right now. We're, we're going this way now. What? Are these things just for bonuses? Okay, cool. And we don't care about those. Oh, I've played a couple of them. Um, but I haven't like really revisited much in a long time. Um, all that stuff is so cool. Like, I really need to just play uh jiggies of time uh because that i remember like when i was gonna play a lot of rom hacks um a lot of those were like still kind of in development i think
No. Like when I did my ROM hack stream a million years ago, I remember I played Bear Waker. But that was like, you know, just the one level. I didn't really get to play... Um, like a Jiggies of Time where it was like, you know, more of a full-fledged game. I was really excited for that one Kirko was working on where it was like all the different, you know, like N64 worlds. I forget what that was called. Nostalgia 64 or something. That looked really cool. Oh, I just saw you released like a new banjo hack. What? He's still working on it? Oh, cool. I'm glad he didn't, like, stop. Oh, my God. We're climbing this. Actually, you know what? We're not climbing. We're, we're going this way now. Oh, so there's three houses? <coughs> Where are the rest of the houses? So I do have to climb. Easy. And I'm going to die. No, see like that. When you just like lose all of your momentum. For like seemingly no reason. So we're we're up here now. That's where we came from. I guess I could have gone over there. What's this candle? See, this kind of platforming is cruel. Cruel and unusual. Oh.
Oh yeah, the grunge. Yeah, it's... I don't know, man. It's really impressive what that guy does. No! No! Oh my god, I'm just never gonna beat this level. So this is just like, general consensus, everyone's least favorite level in the game, probably. See, like that, like, why does my momentum just totally die? Just let it, let it continue, please. I'm trying to go fast, but you're making me do dumb stuff like that. Hey, good thing I brought some Beano. Some Beano. Oh, I tried that again. So I'm an idiot. Your second least favorite? No! Have I already played your least favorite? <laughs> or have I not experienced it yet? A tuchus. Did he have to do the old Jewish guy voice also? Oh, I found another candle. But how does one get up there? All right, and this is where I failed last time. Oh. All right, so you can hop down there for that other candle. What the heck? Why you make me do this game? No. Stop that. See, there we go. Nice, slightly wider plank for us to walk on. Wait, could I have just climbed up that thing? Am I just going up this like a sucker? I kind of want to see the speed run of this. No! No! 
<laughs> Man, why did I have to get greedy? I wanted that extra health. Oh no. Yeah, it's probably a, f a safe bet. Unless there's like some crazy speedrunner strat for, you know, getting all the way up there. I mean, look at look at what they've done with like you know, Mario 64 and some of those levels, they like find ways to glitch through walls and go all the way up. Oh, what did I do here? Yeah, this. Oh my god, get, get me back out. All right, we're back. Dude, how many times you got to write that, Jack? Or maybe Jill wrote it. I don't know, we're, we're losing ground here. Camera. Don't do this to me. Wait, was I really supposed to just climb? This was just to get those. When could I have started that? Just an invisible elevator. Wait, what do you want me to do now? I don't think I can make that jump. And I ain't trying. Whoa! Guys, why are we here?
I'm kind of now I'm tempted to just abandon any hopes I have. No! I just I saved my life there, I guess. Yeah, this is, uh, this is pretty bad. Pretty bad. All right, so that was the candle I just got. I just fall into another? No, I already got that. <laughs> yeah, dude, the third, yeah, the looping music, the random buzzing bee. Like, where the hell is that coming from? Alright, so we were able to climb up some of it. Like we got here. Night, night, baby. Yeah, but now what? Dude, what, <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Yeah, it's fine, James. I don't I don't mind. I don't mind some help. That's right. I, I I remember I got the vampire thing that let me glide. I don't remember how to do it though. Hold jump. Yeah, it might be holding jump.
No. Crap. It's R. Oh, wait, we're all the way back here. Yeah, I remember that other level, you could glide. Once you like transformed or whatever. What? Is that all the way at the bottom? Oh, where was two? <laughs> we never found two. Saved. Can we just fly around and look for look for the wood house? Seems like a viable strat. We get killed by these stupid spiders. <laughs> Cause I'm too lazy to avoid them. Correct. Oh, right, that's where the thing was. A ch another checkpoint?
I don't particularly care. No! Too many buttons. At least there's like some leeway with that. Unlike the the Liu Kang jump. not because when you when you go for the like the pogo it like locks you out you can't do the uh the glide but you know all this time playing gex it's like instinct to go for the pogo like always But that's not the move. Oh, wow, okay. I really thought I really thought I had that. Dude, this slow is no joke. <laughs> New Coke. See, like, I don't get that. Dude, what the hell? Why is that jump so miserable? I'm swinging. Oh, 
All right, we climbed. We're up here. Okay. We have a winner. Wow, that was a uh, that was a thing. Oh, don't you look cute. All right, there was nothing in my dossier about the little girl outfit. I mean, no, we, this is getting ridiculous. Do you think red makes me look fat? <laughs> Dude, why'd you port me back here? Slappy Valley? Lake Flaccid? Alright, so I guess I was here. I have to find my way back there. Really, it's asking a lot. No, we did that. Okay, Toad, or James, what was the purpose of this? What does that give me? Is that something to do with like the starting area? We already went there. Beanstalk. Key card that opens a door. It, that's what it. That's what it looks like. It looks like it has to do with the starting area. Here. Oh. How many of those do I need for another health bar? Twenty. Lock and load, little lizard. All right, we climbed. Jump over three candlesticks. Okay. Oh, will this tell us where the houses are? We know where the first one is. Eh, it's only going to show us that one. Alright, well, let's get this first house. Oh yeah, I didn't see what that like portal was. Was it this one? Yeah, what the hell is that? We're finding out. What? I 
I forget how to look at things. Um, Z C up, Z C down, Z R R C up. How many? I think I have 29 remotes. Excuse me while I kiss the oval program sky. Okay, so it's just a teleport to the t uh, not to the top, to that spot. All right, that's cool. Now, how did I do that? I believe it's Z. And then you hold C up, okay. It barely tends takes me anywhere though. I mean whatever. I guess it's it's not nothing. We gotta, we gotta find this other house. Right there. Hell yeah. What do these purple ones do? Oh. Okay. We're learning. See, that they should have they should have made that jump one that required gliding instead of waiting until you get so close to the top never mind there's another portal Oh, and that's how you get those. You just glide. It all makes so much sense now. Whoops. So I can just fall all the way down now. All right, so that was the first one. See, I wasn't even looking. I didn't pay attention to where the second one was. Which is pretty dumb of me. I don't know why I assumed it was in the same place. Alright. Later. Damn it, where was that? That other teleport? Now I look like an idiot.
Yeah, it's true. It might just be this one. But I thought we watched, like, another one spawn. I feel like a no, it, was, it is just the one. Okay. Sense of me. Oh, what? That was lame. Camera, please. Please. I don't know when I'm going to need that extra health, so. Got to get the easy ones while I can. No, wrong button. Man, I can't believe you guys let me go all the way back up that thing so many times. Whoa, camera. Yeah, honestly, once you understand, once you know about like the teleport and the cape glide, um, the stage isn't as bad. Oh, the teleport? Hey, the teleports are freaking massive, man. Can't imagine I need too many more. That's good to hear. Yeah, this all was way less intimidating with uh, the teleports and the, the glide. Now we have to get the three candles. I at least know where two of them are. That, that was like the second one. Turkey 
Dude, it's B. The bees. Like, what the hell is that, man? I don't know why I'm even bothering with that anymore. Hell yeah. Checkpoint, give me my teleport. You just have to find the boss door. Sweet. Yeah, like, I mean, I, I fought that one boss earlier, and I hadn't even seen that door before. I just, like, stumbled upon it. All right, we got one. All right, that was big, because in the third one, we already know where the third one is. boss of this section of levels. Okay. Oh, okay. I, I see what you mean. That's oh, just another bonus. All the way up there, right? Yep. <gasps> Don't you dare. So easy. Let's get it on. Yes, we have a winner. Right. Like that's oh man. Because the first one you hit shows you where a bonus coin is, right? And I think the second one shows you the teleport, but you don't know what it is. You're just like, yeah, you're probably just like, ah, oh, it's another bonus thing. I'm not going to go all the way back down there <coughs> and check this thing out. But like knowing it's a teleport, I mean, it's a game changer for that level. And the glide. Okay, so if that was the boss for this section of levels. That was this fantasy land and the uh the ben hur land the spartacus land and then this is the bonus area or is that another boss like what is that is that a key card thing it looks like another level, and then there's a bonus one right next to it. No, that is another level. Okay. 
Right, because we fought the boss here. What are you? The rec room. Pretty sure we got everything we could get out of here. It's like the tutorial room, right? Welcome, sir. Please come on in. Entering the training area should allow you to brush up on your skills. to tail whack those hideous dummies. I don't remember doing this. I think as soon as you said, like, it's a tutorial, I just, like, turned around and left. But I'll be annoyed if, like, you know, there's a reward at the end of it. It's like, oh, hey, here's an extra remote. Well, and it's a little more of that. You have to press crouch and then jump. Terrible tutorial. Woo! Now we know what that's for. Beep boop, beep boop. All right, we didn't get anything. Dang. What's that? Like, do I even have access to another area? We went to Fantasyland. We have to go back to Lake Flaccid. Or was there like another zone there? Yeah, there's a second floor for sure. All right, stats. Lake Flaccid, zero out of one remote. Slappy Valley, zero out of one funky town. Yeah, so like the overworlds have a remote in them. As opposed to like the levels here. Hey, yeah, I got a lot of four out of fours. When sushi goes bad, my three can. All right, so there's three levels left I have to find. Bean, or sushi, three goons, super zeros. And then those are like bonuses.
Oh, to open the Gex Vault. On the ropes was a boss. Lions, Tigers, and Gex. I don't know what that is. Res Raker. Where's Res? How do I get there? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm going to the second floor now. We we went to the pole. We did that place. Still can't read. Funky Town. This has got to be. So like maybe it just like automatically opened this door once we beat that boss. Yeah, because I, I I haven't been here. This looks like Shadow Man. Looks like we're about to enter Asylum here. Not enough butt doors, for sure. So I guess there's a like a boss in this overworld and once I beat them that's another key card that'll probably give me access to the final boss to res All right, so there's one level Can we reach it from there? I don't think we reach it. Well, definitely not if we don't jump. What does that do? Oh. Okay. Superhero level is the worst. All right. Oh, this is a boss. Right? Wait, this is Rez. No freaking way. Did you only need 30 remotes? Crap, I didn't hear what he said. Okay. Oh yeah, we got glide again. Honestly, much more enjoyable game 
with this glide mechanic. Like, I'm still gonna, like, die, you know, to dumb stuff. I thought I could go to that ship in the background. Can I not? It's not letting me Z button look. Can't go in there. Right, I mean, you think about it, like, Mario 64 is kind of similar. Like, you can skip a lot, because you, you know, you only need 70 stars to beat the game. But there's 120, like, there's so much you can skip. I think Banjo-Kazooie, you can skip, uh, like, one entire level. Oh, it's an elevator. Oh, well, after the glide thing, that was the f that was the first thing I tried. <laughs> after the glide fiasco. It's like, what happens if I press R? Oh, hey there. Hmm. Unclear what they want me to do here. Yes, yes. That's All right, so that's where the elevator was. And it said there were three of those airlocks. This is gonna cost NASA a fortune. Like, what's that down there? Oh, it's that's just nothing. It's an invisible wall. Oh, fun times. How many other levels could we just glide around? <laughs> I know, right? Well, there was again that one that one level where you like turned into a vampire or something. Like, we're just like supposed to guess about where where to go. All right, we'll hit. What's this? How? <laughs> That's like a like a meme they have with uh, my brothers. Was like, how long has it been wrong? <laughs> How long could we glide? Uh, 
Like, that's where we started. Last time we glided into this. Can we get on top? We can. Is there anything up here for us? No. So then we got here. We opened this airlock. Which apparently I had to do again. Good to know. And then it's just this huge thing. Alright. Maybe there's like more elevators. That'll take us down. I saw that ledge. I was intrigued by that. Oh. Can I... No, turn around, dude. Oh. All right, there's not a path apparently. I was kind of right. All right, can we please turn around? My goodness. Just let me in. All right, so we... We're going counterclockwise, right? We're going to, no, yes. We're going to the right. We're gonna keep going to the right. Apparently you can climb. Yeah, yeah, I, I did notice that James, it was a different color. So I figure it's just another elevator, just drop down there, open the other airlock, go back up. Easy peasy. Oh no! It's like I can't see! Who said that? Oh, the turtle. Dude, it's crazy how much better of a game this is with the glide function. It's like uh, that monster. Have you played Monster Truck Madness yet? Because that game is terrible. Like the it the handling is so bad, in, unless you get the power up that lets you fly, and then it's like the best game ever.
<laughs> Horrible driving game. Excellent flight, Sim. Um, ouch. Okay. Um, what's here? Oh, just, just nothing. You're just dead. All right. I see the other platforms. I just assumed that there was something to do on them. We have 16 lives, all right. Yeah, see, like, I see that... No! Jump! All right, we're, we're, gonna, we're just gonna hang out. What happens if I stay here? Nice. Can I hit it? Am I just supposed to jump? Oh. Yeah, dude, you're really funny. Am I supposed to duck under that? Oh, okay. Okay. And then this I jump. Okay. Just give me the finger wag. R button. What do you want me to do, game? That's what. Ching. We duck. Yep, yep. And then we jump. We are, in fact, geniuses. Same pattern? Oh no, different different weapon? Nope, nope. We're, we're doing the same thing here. Oh, okay, different pattern. Same attacks though. Dude, come on. What's it gonna be first, man? What are we doing? Get ducked on.
So can I just hold the Z button? Alright, where, where, where are we going? Not even getting a new attack on your last health bar? Is there going to be a phase two? Dude, the collision on that is just insanely bad. What am I... What am I doing wrong here? It kind of sucks that after the first time you hit him, he does the same thing, the same pattern every time. Hey, I began this challenge in 2018. Dude, what am I what am I doing wrong here? Oh crap. Do I have to get that the red one? Do I have to get him from all three platforms? Dude, what the hell? Yeah, it was like April, April 2018. Cause it was when I, uh, it was like right around when I started working for VG, VG Bootcamp and I quit the driving school for the second time. No! No! Dude, what am I doing wrong there? Like, that went right to him. This is slowest attacks ever. Of course, I got hit by it. Maybe do I have to hold Z? Or hold, yeah, hold Z. They're hitting him low. Yeah, can I aim higher? I like, these are all hitting him no problem. And then sometimes I would get like that rapid fire. I don't know how I'm doing that. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Apparently. Oh, hey there. Oh, crap.
Oh, come on. What is that sound? Oh man, it like really sounds like something. I just can't put my finger on it. Shoot him, dodge stupid little mythic plus <laughs> mechanic. This can't be, this would be a very fitting ending for this game, but come on. Yep, we have a winner. Oh, okay, so it wasn't like Rez himself. Wait. I purchased Agent Extra and Mr. Gex tickets for a long, relaxing cruise. Mr. Gex kindly offered me the use of his desert island. He thinks that he rescued Extra all by himself, but we all know that he couldn't possibly have done it without my help. <laughs> hey, Georgie, what's up, dude? <laughs> oh, man. That is... Amazing timing. Amazing timing. That is too funny. As you can see, we have beaten Gex 3. <laughs> James is just double boxing both of our channels <laughs> yeah well you, I, to be fair i don't have to stop the stream now we're just done with gex so i i accomplished my goal of beating gex before the year is over like this is the end of the game right guys it, like we're good i don't want i don't know if there's like a fake out it is the end Maybe we'll get a glimpse of the three levels I didn't have to play. That's really funny. Uh, this game gets a solid meh recommendation from me. We'll add it to the list. I'm not a huge fan, but I totally... I see the appeal in it. And... Um, I think once you like fully understand the game and all the mechanics, it's it's more tolerable. Um, I like it better than the first Gex. Wow, for the record, on my recommendations tab, there are more yeses than anything else. Man, it feels good to uh, end the game. Eight. 51, 50, finally another entry. I don't know, do I, do I load up, uh, do I load up Shadow Man Remaster now? Or do we just, are we just happy that we're done? 
Dude, I, so like, I saw very small bits and pieces of um, the Beast playing Indiana Jones, and it looked like pretty enjoyable. I don't know, it just looked like a really big like adventure game, but maybe I'm like really mistaken. Oh yeah, you mean it's just it's really long? Yeah, it is, I heard it. I heard it is pretty long. Yeah, I did. I did hear that. Hey, I, I mean, it's just not like Aiden Chronicles, right? I hear that one's the, like the longest. I guess it depends. You know, a game like uh, StarCraft might take someone the longest, getting through all six campaigns. Four hundred pages. Is there like a lot of optional content in it? <laughs> uh, let's see. So Gax is game 164. 3D platformer, one more game done. Got to update my stats. Let's see. Top 20. What list? What list does this game belong on? Not one of the longest. Definitely not one of the best adventures or stories or most unique. Most rage inducing. I have to put Gex. Gex 1 on that one. <laughs> This game wasn't as rage inducing. Um, all right, definitely not best of anything. Worst platformer? Yeah, this yeah, this is okay. The first Gex is number 1. Uh Chameleon Twist is the next one. I did it, Jared. I did it. It happened. It's official. We did it. Uh, so the first Chameleon Twist game, I think, is not a good game. The first one. Um, the platforming just isn't good. It's just not. It's very rough. It's a very rough game. Um, the second Chameleon Twist game was significantly better. Um, I think I think Chameleon Twist is is like hard carried by nostalgia. Um, the second one is like legit good though. But the, the first one it was it was too too rough. Oh wow, we did it! We're we're back to the title screen. All right. 